Laura and I just got up to Bly, Oregon. Little, little town. We stopped at the, uh, the Chevron here. There's not much going on. There's a nice Jeep under that cover over there. Laura, you have to stay. Stay. Laura's learning to stay in the car. Stay. I'm going to go get some ice. Some water. No. Stay. Laura, stay. No. This is some water. Oh, she worries me. So on Monday I was headed east down the road here and it was 3 o'clock in the afternoon and it was filthy hot and Nora was tired and needed some water and we really needed a place to stop because I was all out of gas. No gas money. And this is what it was looking like. Like we were going to have to pull off on the side of the road with no shade and uh, it was going to be nasty. It's a real barren landscape. And then just up the road here, when it was looking like this, like there was nothing around, and I was about to run out of gas. It was looking real barren. came across this little sign for the Sprag River picnic area. And right down there is where I camped last night, the Sprag River. Worked out awfully nice. So now we're back on the road, headed east to Lakeview, about 43 miles. Then we're going to get gear there, more supplies and groceries, and clean up a bit and upload some videos, and then uh, figure out where we're going to go from there.
I am in Lakeview, have been all day, working on a few things, buying some supplies, I'm headed to the grocery store to get some dinner right now. Tomorrow morning I get to meet my mechanic at 8 o'clock named Jesse, I'll take the camera this time. He's a, uh, he's a cool guy that runs a little shop out of his house. He, uh, he races Camaros in his spare time. He's got a nice looking garage in his house. Anyways, Jerry's Restaurant, huh? That sounds pretty good. That's a diner. Might have to get breakfast here. And here is Highway 140. Headed through Lakeview. It's about 6.30 in the evening, I'm standing in the middle of the road. Nice place. <laughs> Look at the good puppy. What are you doing? What are you doing out there? Who tied you up like that? What cruel person would do that to you? Huh? Go in and get food for himself and he's not even going to share any. Hi baby.